You're okay. Come on. Quit cowering and behold the face of your rescuer. It was really no problem. I just swung my axe around and those fire imps, they didn't stand a chance. Ooh, sometimes it's hard being this capable. <sighs> Excuse me, you're supposed to be watching as I flex on you? Yeah, come on, let's get you up. We're rivals, so it's actually kind of demeaning to me if you have a face full of dirt. Stand up straighter, what's wrong with you? You have dust on your robes too, come on. Have some self-respect. Oh, you have dirt on your face because I pushed you to the ground? <sighs> yeah, to protect you. If I wanted to humiliate you, I would have spat on you when I did it. <laughs> I'm kidding. God, you're so serious and buttoned up. Oh, you had a harrowing experience. Yeah, the two-foot-tall fire imps were gonna beat you up and take your books and eat your homework. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, you're cute when you cross your arms and huff at me. Wait. Hold that retort. Where did they come from? Fire imps shouldn't be this close to the village. <laughs> A summoning gone wrong, you say? Well, good thing I'm here to clean up your mess. You must have fled. Where did you try to summon them? In your home? Well, don't worry. I'm your rival, not your enemy. What do you mean, so? So... Lead the way. Back to your home. I'll help you eliminate any stragglers. There's bound to be one or two hanging around. You're welcome. You don't have time for this. Some fire imp is probably torching your precious book collection. <laughs> yeah, that'll put some pep in your step. Let's go, you nerd. Well, excuse me for walking down the hallway slowly. I've always wondered what it looks like inside. I've never been to your home before. Look slowly around that corner. Exactly. It's just the one imp and we have the drop on it. I'll go in first, make it turn its back to you, you hit it with an ice spell. Bada bang, bada boom. Ah. 
I'm sorry, did you just snicker at my battle plan? Whatever, I'm trying it out. I don't think it's that lame. Shut up. I'll push you in the dirt again. That'll be bada bing bada boom. Ugh, whatever. Not taking pointers from someone with these kind of portraits on their walls. By the way, that one is crooked. Hmm. Get your spell ready. I'm going in. Got it. Come on. Ugh, down it goes. Nice work. Got it in the middle of the back. Though I wouldn't have expected anything less. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where are you going? Oh, you need to check on your books? No, you need to stay right here with your back against the wall. Why? Because you owe me. I protected you and your stupid library. You owe me. So I'm just gonna put my hands on either side of your head, keeping you bracketed here. Mmm, how do you like that? <laughs> Stop joking around. Hey, I could be very serious right now for all you know. You're my rival after all, even if you've never truly accepted that title from me. It's quite insulting. It's a badge of honor. Hmm. Don't you dare deny it. Not when we're this close. I could see the veins in your eyes right now. We've been rivals ever since you blew into town with your fancy spells. Do you have any idea how frustrating it is? Oh, are you gonna play dumb? Who do you think kept this town safe before you came along? I grew up here. You just showed up one day for research. People didn't even know your name. <sighs> the nerve. I wish you were more hateable. I really do. But you have these wide eyes and this expression that makes my heart feel funny. And it's all your fault, really. It's your fault you're here right now. Trapped in your home with an axe-wielding person with less than scrupulous intentions. Could be worse, though. Oh, you agree? Good. That's gonna make this a lot easier. <laughs> K 
Come here, you fool. Mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. Oh, you're sweet tasting, aren't you? Yeah, I could get used to that. Let me take you out for dinner. You still don't know this town like I do. Oh, we can protect it together. If you can keep up with me. Sure. I've liked you for a while, actually. Since the first day, but I had to hate you first. You took my job. I know you didn't mean to. <sighs> I'll make you something really tasty. We'll have a fantastic picnic. What do you like to eat? Good. Look forward to it, okay? <laughs> Hey, are you asleep? I just wanted to say happy anniversary. It's not our anniversary until the sun rises. No, I want to celebrate now. Besides, you worked so hard. You deserve it. To be celebrated. Hmm. Yeah, I did too. Those orcs attacking the village didn't kill themselves. Alright, fine. We'll celebrate once we wake up. But let me help you go back to sleep, okay? Yeah, take a deep breath in. Hold it. And a long, slow, heroic breath out. There you go. Can you feel my hands touching the side of your cheek? Yeah. There you go. I'm so glad I have you as a partner. I'm so glad I got over that grudge I had. Because you're amazing, and I'm so glad I got to get to know you, to love you. I know, I know. I just want you to rest now, okay? We'll celebrate in the morning. All right. Sweet dreams, baby.
Yeah, you're blinking away all that sunshine in your eyes. Is it finally our anniversary? Oh, good. I couldn't wait anymore. How did you sleep? Fine, aside from me waking you up. How dare you. <laughs> I can't help it. I'm excited. You know, I spent all that time hating you, and now we're actually together. Defeating monsters like an adventuring couple. Maybe you'll we'll even leave the village someday. <laughs> what do you think of that? Bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> Stop it, I'll hit you with a pillow. No, no rolling over. No covering your head. The sun is up. We've been together for one year already, and there's so much we have to do. Yeah, I have our whole day planned. We're gonna get your favorite breakfast at the bakery, and then we're gonna go for a picnic, a nature walk, and then a really special dinner. Maybe I prepared a poem. Don't laugh at me. My poem is going to make you cry. It's incredible. Well, we can't do any of that unless you wake up. Come on. Remember the fire imps? I looked at your books. I know how to summon them. I'll bring them all back. Unless you stand up right now. Okay, fine. Sit up. Good. No, I was just threatening you. Your books look like gibberish to me. That's okay. It makes you mysterious. <laughs> Come on, beautiful. The sun is shining and the world is waiting for us. We're strong and in love, so... Actually, the sun shines just for us. You don't want to disrespect it, do you? <laughs> I am egotistical, but only because I met the love of my life. Come on. I'm ready, and so are you. Give yourself a big stretch. Feel all your limbs tighten, and then relax, and get out of bed. We got stuff to do, and I got loving to give. <laughs> I mean it, though. Come on. I'm too excited to sleep. 